Hello, Christabel Tribe, and welcome to Tribal Council. We're back again. I have some questions for y'all. So, are things starting to get tense now? This is for Gabby. Are things starting to get tense now that you keep coming back to Tribal Council? How are you handling the increasing tension and stress? I have horrible service. Can you repeat that? Yeah. Are things starting to get more tense now that you keep coming back to tribal? And how are you handling the tension and the stress? Um, I think it sucks that we have to keep coming back to tribal. I think the stress won't, like, it's not going to go away. Um, I don't really know how I've been handling it. I guess that's okay. my answer. <laughs> Thank you very much. Matt? With the majority of the cruise tribe never go to tribal, how do you think this will affect the game when we when we finally get to merge? Um, I don't. I I'm intrigued to see what happens with them. Like I think not going to tribal can be difficult, and from what we've gathered from cruise, it's not it's not super straightforward. There, it doesn't seem like they're all on the same page, and maybe there are. Uh, I don't know that maybe the, the dynamic is not as good. And so I think that, you know, when we get to merge, like I think we've been working together for a long time and we all really like each other. And so maybe we would, might have an advantage, but it's a numbers game. And if we keep coming back here, we definitely don't have the advantage. So uh, that's something we got to figure out how, how to win some challenges. Thank you very much, Morgan. So at this point, you have lots of experience voting people out. Does that make it easier or harder to see someone go? And why? Um, It definitely makes it harder because at the beginning, um, you know, there's those people that are, it's early on. You don't have those connections. You see chaos. You We can kind of like unify and be like, all right, let's get the chaos out of here. Um, we're way, we're deeper in the game. We've all talked to each other at this point. I think we have all agreed that we have like a very, we all, we're not crews. <laughs> so we kind of have like great person, not that they don't have great personalities, but we have like good person <laughs> to talk to each other. So of course, like at this point, it's going to be very difficult because we have created some kind of relationship with everyone. Okay. Thank you very much. Ray, I know you're eating, but can you answer a question? Yeah, I'll answer your question. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. So are alliances and loyalties set in stone at this point, or are they constantly changing? What do you value in an ally at this stage? I feel like you asked me this last tribal. Oh, well, I'm asking you again. Okay. I'm just saying, I mean, I don't mind answering you again, but um, so what I really value in an ally is somebody that I feel I could communicate with, uh, oh my god excuse me <laughs> that's what you get I just ate so that's what's gonna happen um I value somebody who can communicate with me and um I just I really I guess that's it I really value that communication between me and like potential allies people that I feel like um you know it, it's hard in this game because I feel like there's such a balance sometimes too like I don't want to talk too much game because then I'm going to seem aggressive, but I don't want to talk too much game because then I'm going to seem like a goat, right? Um, but I just really value, like, when people tell me where their head is at and, like, I don't have to, like, wonder where I'm at, right? Even, um, even if there's, like, a pause or whatever and we're able to come back to it, like, I, I, I'm okay with that. Um, in terms of our alliances set in stone, I mean, like, I feel like after last tribal... I don't even know what's up and down anymore. <laughs> I don't know. Like, I can't, I feel like, I feel like I have no clue what's going on sometimes. Okay, thank you. Keisha. Yeah, I'm going to go finish my Chipotle now. Enjoy. Keisha. So what is this vote based on for you? Is it based on tribe strengths for future challenges so you might win? Or is it based on loyalty? Or is it based on a mixture of both? I mean, I think it's a little bit of both with the idea that I don't want to be the person who's sticking my neck out and creating 
problems, you know? So I feel like I'm just going to maybe go along with majority. Um, and I feel like the majority, though, is trying to think about tribe strength and us down the line. So I, I think it goes hand in hand. Um, so, yeah, I think it goes together. Thank you. And last but not least, a question. Open the floor. So what kind of seasoning or spice would you rate this tribal? Is it something mild? Are we a little bit salty? Is it really spicy? What kind of seasoning or spice would you rate it? Anyone can answer this one. We're not super spicy, I don't think. Yeah, I, I think we're like pretty we're, kind of we're pretty like mild. mild. I was gonna say mild, yeah. We kind of yeah. like come through consensus I, and just kind of like keep it chill. Mark here. was saying we're that we needed to respectful. add more spice. So <laughs> let's yeah, leave. We're kind of the cool and classy Mark. kids in, on this side of the world. Episode title there. Um, so with that, I'm going to open it up to Prod. Anyone else want to ask anything? I have a question. Um, and if you're not on camera, please use the reaction, but I'm going to do the typical. Please raise your hand if you think you could be going home tonight. Pretend I'm raising my hand. Okay. So everyone. All righty. Um, can you keep your hand raised if you like actually truly think you're getting votes tonight? Okay. So I've heard my name, so that's possible. Couple... I got two last time couple less people already thank you fabulous would anyone else like to say anything before we go to the votes please don't write me down mark isn't here so i'm hoping that all that's gone but just in case don't write me down thank you sam it looks like the tribe's spoken yeah okay bye <laughs> no come back kitten oh my god not he left Anyway, so I'm now going to send Brandon to the voting booth. And you'll be sent one by one to cast your vote. This is also your time to do any shout outs or say hi to people or just a general chit chat. Back to. Hi, Malcolm, if you're watching, I see you're an alumni who's in the, the list of people who are active right now. Oh, and Marcelo, hi, if you're watching. Shout out to my prod guest that is not active at all in my chat, so. <laughs> Still love you though. Ditto. <laughs> we love the non-active prod chat. Do they get to watch this, the prod chat people? No. So we're shouting out they need to be in the VL. Since no one else is doing shout outs, I'd just like to shout out Survivor Now podcast, who have just finished their review of um, Survivor Cambodia, Second Chances. We will be reviewing season 45. If anyone wants to subscribe, we will be doing multiple shows weekly. That Survivor Now podcast.
Ollie, you're muted. Babe, I'm not trying to speak. Damn, sorry. He said, I do not want to talk to y'all. Um, Sam, who's next for the voting booth? There you go. Never mind. Who was Matthew? They're on their way. Um, I'd like to give a shout out to Stardew Valley for keeping me sane when I don't want to do my homework. I'd like to give a shout out to Monopoly Go for completely feeding my addiction that I don't need fed, but you know, it's bringing together me and some of my old friends. So and he should be my friend on that. I'm obsessed. Oh my gosh, you need to join our server that we created to help trade and do stuff. Oh my god, send it to me. Thank you. Wait, 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 wait. What game is this? Say it again. Monopoly Go. Monopoly Go. What? Like yes. Pokemon okay. Go? When but travel's Monopoly? over, I'll send you the link. Oh my god, do it. I love Monopoly, so yes, please. <laughs> it's so addictive. It's ridiculous. Yeah, send, send me the link to the server. Thanks. Right By the way, can I shout out um David Cedar, who I'm hopefully going to see in LA next week? Sweet, sweet. But Sam, in the server, we right now have a hack to get all of those dice from the invite a friend thing. And so people are slowly going through people to like get them to those dice. Oh my god, I'm, I'm there. We are like psycho. It's bad. It is a bad addiction. <laughs> like, we created a server for it. That's how bad it is. It's phenomenal. I'm in a chat, but I'm not. That's the worst I've got. Yeah, no, like me and my friend, like, because we kept chatting about it and we were like, had little group chats and we were like, she was like, should we create a server? Is that too much? I was like, no, I literally was thinking about doing it, but I thought it was too much too. But if we both just do it, <laughs> then it's better if it's two people, right? So we created it and started adding. Uh, I'm a crackpot. I've already got like 120 of the stickers for this for this one. Oh yeah, I'm at like 130 some. Oh my god. I got duplicates of like almost everything else that I have and I've been giving away. I don't know what we're looking at. What Joe happened? Jonas Joe Jonas has reportedly hired a divorce lawyer after four years of marriage. What are you um, hello? What? Fake news, maybe? Possibly. This is the third time I saw it on my Facebook, so I'm like... Mm -hmm. I don't have any, like, other... New York Magazine. New York Magazine posted it. It's gotta be fake. Everyone's gone. I'm closing the booth. I'm not feeling this. It's almost candy corn season. I've never had candy corn. What is it? Something that Americans have made that is not good for you. <laughs> what Probably <is> plastic. <laughs> okay. Even Americans don't know what candy corn is. <laughs> that was, <laughs> I had my first first corn dog the other day. It was amazing. Oh, corn dog slap. God, that was phenomenal. Korean corn dog slap even more because it's mozzarella and a dog. Oh my god. Goodness me. <laughs> well, on that lovely conversation, I have the votes. Um, if everyone all right, wants to get on camera. Um, so before I read the votes, if anyone has anything they would like to play or say or use, now is the time to do so. Okay then. So guys, once the votes are read, the decision is final. Person voted out will be asked to leave the Zoom. So I have the votes. First vote. Gabby. That's one vote, Gabby. Next vote. Gabby. That's two votes, Gabby. Third vote. Matthew. That's two votes, Gabby. One vote, Matthew. Next vote. Matthew. That's two votes, Matthew. Two votes, Gabby. Three votes left. Next vote. Gabby. That's three votes, Gabby. <clears throat> Six vote. Matthew. 
That's three votes, Matthew, three, go, three votes, Gabby, one vote left. Seventh and final vote. And the next person voted out of Triumph the Galapagos, Matthew. Matthew, tonight four is enough, and unfortunately you have been voted out. If you have any final words, please now say them. Thank you guys so much. This has been fun, and I'm excited to get my life back. So good luck, you guys. Love you, Matthew. Unfortunately, you, Matthew. though, the tribe has spoken. Torch snapped. Please leave the team. Okay, guys. So another vote down. It seems like it was a blind side. Will Good that job, thing ladies. continue? Yay, ladies! <laughs> oh, we did it. Sorry, we just a second. Was <laughs> Gabby's frozen and freaking out. I'm sure in the car. Right, we can end the Zoom now, Sam. Ah! <laughs> or the recording, at least. Okay.